In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create presets and also apply pre-made presets in Lightroom. So let's jump into it. So first thing is first, you wanna open your photo and you wanna do the edits to it uh, if you're creating your own preset. And after you do that, you want to go up to the edit tab, which you should already have open if you were editing. And then at the top, you'll see in the left-hand corner, you, you will see presets. So if you select that, there's these pre-made presets that you can hover your mouse over and it will basically just apply those presets to your photo um, for you to view it. And if you tap on it, it'll obviously apply the preset to the photo. But if you wanna take the edits that you made and create your own custom preset, then you go up here to the top and you'll see three options. Uh, one of the options is a plus symbol and that is how you create your preset. So I'm gonna call this Vibrant Warm and I'm gonna call it Vibrant Warm June because the photo was taken in June. And then um, you can group it under user presets or you can create a new group. I'm just gonna leave it user presets and then you choose uh, what you want the preset to store. So the detail, effects, color, light, um, profile, and optics. So you can also go into each of these menus and their sub menus, um, and you can add white balance or remove it. Uh, same with vibrant saturation. Uh, for the sake of this, I'm just gonna leave everything and save the preset. So vibrant warm June was added to your user presets. So now if I go to yours and user presets, we'll see vibrant warm June in here. And then I can apply this to uh, different photos. So that is how you make presets. And that's all there really is to it. If this video helped you out at all, please make sure to hit the subscribe button and notification bell. That way you're updated when I create new videos. And also please make sure to give this video a thumbs up. That way it ranks higher in the algorithm. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video.